but uh, I always wanted to know who the best player was on tour simply because I wanted to actually work as hard. And then I ran into a, a little guy by the name of George Knudsen out of Canada. And I watched him hit the golf ball. I watched him with the wide stance, taking the club back way inside, releasing the club. One of the greatest ball strikers I'd ever seen. If he had a problem with the game, it was always with his putting. I remember playing uh, golf with George Knudsen when I first came out on the tour, and I had played some golf with Ben Hogan. And uh, I thought the two had uh, remarkably similar golf swing. I probably played with... I think a lot of the great players out here, and the guys that stick in my mind as the really great shot makers are, are Ben Hogan, uh, Sam Snead, George Knudsen, and Lee Trevino. I can tell you that George Knudsen is one of the finest ball strikers ever. I would put him maybe just a shade behind, uh, uh, I'll say, Snead, Hogan, and Nelson for hitting the ball. He could really hit the ball straight and do what he wanted to with full shot. And the only thing that, that, that kept him from winning more championships was his putting. One of the great ball strikers in my mind that, that I have seen ever play the game. We don't have players like that on the tour anymore. Uh, we don't have the artists like, like George that could really maneuver the ball. And, and I think the, the world of golf needs more George Newsons. George was a thoughtful man who had a reason for most things he did. If you got him alone, he'd tell you about them. I have a set plan for every golf tournament I play in. I used to tee it up, try and make this par on the first hole, and then I would just try and play a nice, quiet round of golf, try and hit every fairway, every green, and try and two putt. Never try and one putt. I like to wear something that's quiet. My whole theme is to be in control of myself. There's a thing that Percival calls homeostasis. This is, if I rest quietly, then I feel that I'm quiet. It's a, it's a, I, I will do anything that I can so that I can maximize myself, and being calm is something that you have to. I wear the sunglasses because with them, I don't have to squint. I can see better and keep my eyes open, more aware of what's going on. Smoking? It's just a lousy habit, and I wish I didn't have it. But I've got my long game going, I would say, is, well, it's 99% of the time. It's through the years of dedication or in developing a golf swing that has made this happen. I'm not shocked at all or surprised when I go out and I knock the ball against the hole time and time and time again. George played practice rounds with his friend and idol, Ben Hogan. The two of them shared a deep disdain for putting, as well as a sense of humor about their mutual ineptness. Ben Hogan said to me, he said, George, he said, I don't mind you trying coffee by swing, but leave my putting alone. <laughs>